Hello friends, I hope you all are doing well today. Today we are looking at a brand new Polly Pocket Compact, the Groom and Glam Poodle. It's a super cute compact with some water features, which isn't always my favorite when it comes to Polly Pocket, but hopefully this one won't be too bad. Here we can see the other two new Polly Pocket sets that are coming out very soon. I think they are arriving next month, looking forward to that. But for now, let's just look at this cute little poodle compact. And here it is, the very first Polly Pocket Compact of the year. How exciting is that? It's this adorable pink poodle with a purple bow in her hair. Her eyes are closed. She has a pink heart cheek, a black heart nose, and a gold Polly heart collar. She also has a purple cord, which is really easy to remove if you so wish. I'll just keep this off just so it's not getting in the way. And on the back, we see lots of images related to a hair salon, like a comb, scissors, bows, hairspray, blow dryer, eyelashes, ribbons, and of course, a paw print. You'll also notice this strange hole in the back. It almost looks like a keyhole and looks like you could turn it. I don't think you can, but I haven't tried. But since this is a water themed set, I think it's a drain hole or an air hole or both for if the water gets between the two layers of plastic, it has a place to either drain out or at least dry out. How well does it work? I'm not sure. I guess we'll find out. So here it is, super cute set. The first thing you notice is that super glossy background because my light is glaring off of it really bad. I'll try not to blind you guys, but how pretty and shiny is that? I guess they probably did that since there are water features. They don't want anything getting ruined, which I really appreciate. So let's start up here at the top. First, we see a purple counter with a little plant here. We have a peg for someone to stand in front and a peg here on the counter. Behind the counter on that super glossy background, we see a computer, a bag with maybe a lotion bottle, a lamp, some nail polish. I guess this is probably where you would have your nails done. We see a couple of white shelves there with just bottles and bags and a neon sign of a hand giving a peace sign. We see more nail related things fingernail polishes, a cool green lamp hanging down over right here, and a couple of plants here in the corner. We also have another peg here for someone to stand. Moving down this way, we have some gold stairs leading to a very narrow spot right against the wall. Don't love that, but whatever. We also have another neon sign here of scissors and a comb. On these gold stairs, we just see some sparkles and shines, bows, scissors, comb, an arrow and paw prints. To the left, we have a see-through blue door. We can see paw prints and a robe hanging on the door and we can open this door and it's a shower. Of course, back there is more glossy background. We see a shower, some towels and a loofah. Now what's really cool about this and we'll see how well it works. Like I said, I don't love using water with my Polly Pockets, but I'm going to do it for this video so you guys can see. We have a peg here for a doll to stand. I don't know if I'll get my dolls under the water not. But if you close this door, you can see this little opening right here and a little spout. It's really cool. What they did is you can pour water into here, give one of your characters a shower, and it just drains right into the tub below. I think that was really smart on their part. And it also looks like the water will be fairly well contained inside this. They have the walls come up a little bit. They probably could have gone a little bit higher because some water could potentially get trapped in there. Moving on, we have a little vanity area, I guess, and underneath we can see, what do we see? A little dog bread and I don't know, just a bottle and some bones, I think. Above that, it's a cute gold mirror, a leash and some bottles. Here we have a dog house. We see a cute little dog holding a bone, laying on a pink bed. And I guess either that's a window or a TV. I'm not really sure, probably a window and some paw prints on the wall. We also have another peg for one of our dogs. So that is it for the top. We move on to the bottom and we have a huge, huge blue tub or swimming pool. We have three pegs here. We also have an attached hot tub with another peg. It's in the shape of a heart with a couple of spots for our dolls to sit. You'll see there is a hole right there in the middle. That's because this is another one of the water features. If you look down here at this big pink paw print, there is a lighter pink heart right in the middle. It's actually a button. When we push it, it is going to make the water bubble in the hot tub. I'm nervous to do this. My friend Bug 
rug. She got her set a couple of days before I did. She tried it out. She said it worked and it was really cool, but be careful because the water will leak through here. So I'm kind of nervous, but I really want to try it out. So we will in a minute. So here we have some gold steps going down. We have a purple floor. I appreciate that they didn't put any cardboard, even the glossy kind down here. Since we will be dealing with water right here, the less paper, the better. On the floor is just some bows and hearts and three pegs. We also have a little bed here for an animal. If we move over here, we see some blow dryers. Our dolls can sit here in the gold seats and pull down the red see-through hair dryers. Move along this side, we have a light purple counter with just different hair things. We need a blow dryer, a flat iron, a curling wand, a peg, a comb, scissors. What is that? Another comb, I guess, with a handle. This is probably for the dogs. I think that is some sort of like shedding tool that you get the undercoat with and some towels probably. And I would guess these are supposed to be mirrors. We also have a pink chair that swivels. I guess that's it for the set. So you know what time it is. It is time for the accessories. So first we get this purple pitcher. It's very cute. This is what we can use to fill our set up with water. Now this little pitcher will not fit inside of the set, but it easily just clips on to the cord attached to the compact so that it's easy to keep it safe and with the compact. We get this deep pink couch. We have seen this before. Nothing new here. We also get this light pink Heart that has just hair styling equipment various things on it we've also seen this piece before we get an extra orange chair a pink dog bed some very tiny accessories here a silver blow dryer and silver scissors for our dogs we get this blue bone shaped water and food dish it wouldn't be a dog set without a little brown poop we get this little brown dog pretty sure we've seen this guy before we also get these two poodles. Now these poodles are fun because they're actually color changing. This one is orange and this one is purple. We will try out the color changing feature in just a minute. And for our dolls, we get two. This little lady with short brown hair, a blue shirt with a dog on it and pink pants. And this girl with long red hair, a purple shirt with a poodle on it. Is that a poodle? It almost the hair looks like a poodle, but the face almost looks like a woman, but I think it's probably the poodle from the set, like the face of the compact. I don't know. Now that we have looked at the set and the accessories, let's go ahead and check out the water features, starting with the color changing dogs. All right, so I have some hot water here and some cold water here. Let's get our little dogs and see what happens when we put them in the water. So we'll start with the purple poodle. If we put her in hot water, let's see. She changes to pink. Super cute, let's put her back in the cold water. And she changes back to purple. Now what about our orange poodle? Put him in the hot water. Hmm, guess he changes kind of a light pink. It's not as drastic as the purple poodle. You can kind of tell a the difference there. And back in the cold water, plunk into the hot water you go. Fun, fun, fun. Let's try them both at once. Double the fun. Now we have two pink poodles. And back in the cold. Very cool and very messy. Now this is the part I'm most scared about trying out the water features in the compact. I'm so scared of ruining something, but it should be pretty safe, right? We got this. All right, so I have a little bit of water here in my pitcher. I'm going to go ahead and fill up our hot tub. So we're just supposed to press this button and we should get bubbles. Uh, it works. And there's even something floating around in the hot tub. So realistic. So that works and that's pretty cool. I guess the next thing we have to test out, there's not much to test out here with the shower. We know it's gonna work, but let's go ahead and see what happens. Doing this one-handed while filming is probably not the smartest thing I've ever done, but here we go. I mean, it's working, right? Give somebody a bath here. Let's put the poodle in. Feel the, ooh, the water's getting high, guys. Ooh, I'm getting scared, okay barely reaches them. 
There we go, we get the idea, it works. And now I need to go dry this out. So there you go guys that was the new Polly Pocket Groom and Glam Poodle Compact. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you had fun watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you are having a wonderful day and I hope to see you in the next video. Bye.